I've just arrived at Portsmouth. It's a Tuesday night. We're at Eastney Beach and uh, we're doing a Southern League in Open match, which is slightly unusual because obviously they're normally on a Saturday. <laughs> Mr. Delaney? Yeah, mate, you right? Yeah, I'm good, mate. Yourself? Yeah, going for the midweek? Yeah. Keep it going, mate. Old head of HR is back, look. Jimmy, you Peg, peg number eight, I am. Eight? Eight. Ooh. I haven't drawn yet. I'll come and see you later. Do you reckon I'm going to win it? Yeah, I reckon so. <laughs> it's not Jimmy Wills, we're in all over. <laughs> oh, Wilson's here, look. Here he is. Hello, How are you, mate? Yeah, sexing on our way. How did you get on last uh, Saturday? You even How asked. did you get on, mate? I'll you told me you were going to win it. Two ounces, didn't you? <laughs> oh, I smashed you up, didn't I? I had six oh. ounces, is it? <laughs> no, it was uh, very awful. Only because he had one dog, he got a pickup. That's what it was. What did you get then, last Saturday? I had one dog, one sausage white, and um, ten top ups. You were in the money, weren't you? Yeah, sir. That's good, isn't it? That's a, that's a good start, mate. Yeah. Here's old Darren the dogfish, look. Five sex toys around again. What mate? sex toys are you using? <laughs> Got to watch these Sussex boys, Mr. Kramer. <laughs> Number eight. Go take that, Jimmy. If you don't win from there, is that right down the end, is it? <laughs> so right at park at the end of the at the end of where you can park. Toilet block. That's at the end, isn't it? Hundred yards in for the toilet block. Yeah. Take one. Oh right, right. Wicked. I don't wanna see you. I don't wanna hear you tonight. I don't wanna fight you. You don't wanna know if I feel alright. Right, we've just uh, we've just done the first cast. Um, got to be a bit quick on the old midweek. I was messing about a bit. Of course, you haven't got long to set up and stuff. So uh, I was defrosting the mackerel five minutes before casting. Out. <laughs> um, right, so first cast, I've gone um, free hook clip down here as hard as I can. Second cast, well, we'll see what happens if any if I see any fish come up. But we've got some sort of shorter flapper rigs well short snoods on sort of uh, longer flapper rigs um trying to pick up a white in maybe a few sizable pout um there's quite often rays come up from here it doesn't look very much like ray conditions but um there's always a lucky ray comes up generally uh bait wise we've got mackerel tipped off a squid typical sort of white in we've also got um we've got some rag and i'll probably tip that off a squid as well we've got a few blacks as well so um bit of everything um let's bait up again because i'm gonna have to do second cast in a minute and let's hope uh, for a bit of a run in the midweek league right second cast coming really close undersized but uh there's something on the uh, board everything over 18 centimeters today that's about 17 so just under but um a fish is a fish we've got dino next door He's an England international and he's been catching. I think he's had three, two or three size balls and a, a top up already. Uh, and I, I think he's just cast him real close. So I've got to copy him a bit tonight. We're fishing from 8 to 11.30. It's 9.25. I cast a little bit further. And we've got two uh, sizable white in, about 23 and 21-ish. Got to go and weigh them in now, but hey, we've got some sizable fish. How's it going then, D? You know what are we on? You missed our six or seven sizable. Yeah, 23.75 out. Is it? I think you'll, you've caught more than anyone else I've heard of. No, it's, not, it's not great, is it? No, no, it's quite hard work. Oh, it's a little bite there, yeah, they are small tonight, aren't they? No, I'm glad it's not a normal seven league because we would have had nothing sizable at all. <laughs> Another sizable one at 20 centimetres. It's, uh, it's something. Uh, the time is 10 o'clock, hour and a half left. Catching them a bit further out now. So uh, we continue doing that. Pretty much all on fishy bait, all sort of mackerel tipped off a squid. Seems to be the name of the game today. Let's get it signed off. Do you think you'll be out with the England team this year? 
I'd like to, but just seeing what this COVID stuff does, to be honest with you. Yeah, and having a lot of good for the old England teams, has it? Not. You get prepared for stuff and then it gets cancelled. Nothing you can do about it, but it's a bit annoying. Have you won any medals with England yet? No, I'm not actually representing them yet. Oh, um, you haven't? So no, you've been in there? Oh, that's I've even worse. Like two years and COVID is... <laughs> Uh, so in England international for two years and you yeah. haven't actually fished for him. Yeah, well, well, we yeah. well, if it goes on much longer, you have to be in the senior team. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll have to start catching pop. Yeah. <laughs> right, so that's my... Oh, here you go. <laughs> that's my fifth sizable whiting. Um, and I think we've well, got one pop-up as well. Uh, I'm not doing the best around me, but I'm not doing the worst. Um, I think Dino's in front of me next door, but... Having quite a nice night, I quite like these midweek leagues. Um, I thought the first hour wasn't really in my swing of things, but now, fishing quite well. What's happening over here then? Right. So what have you caught so far? Two white. Two white in, what, the top, uh, they're sizable? Sizable, yeah. No, no top ups? No top ups. Ah, but you've done one seven league, you've done a main seven league one last year in Gory, and you've done one and you won it. That was it, yeah. <laughs> what did you win, uh, what was it, Congo you had? Two Congas. Two congers, big yeah. ones. Yeah, big enough. Big enough for the win. Big enough for the win. There aren't many people that just turn up to a seven league and win it on that main main uh, Saturday, is there? Luck on my side that day, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you you've been doing well up the river in that, haven't you? Yeah, I've done alright in the flounder matches. Yeah, well, I haven't done any flounder ones this year. I struggles with the mud. Yeah. yeah <laughs> but I don't really like digging reds. <laughs> it's horrendous. It's very nice, is it? How's Jamie getting on? I don't know. No. I haven't seen a lot of action over there. Ah. Black next door's about a few. How was he? I think he's had a dab. I've just had another um, top up white in. It's a shame because well, it was the last cast now, 15 minutes to go. It's quarter past 11. Um, about an hour ago, I was getting a fish a cast with three or four casts, and I really found them and got into them, and no one else was catching, but um, they seem to have disappeared. Dogfish on the last cast. I could be in the game. Otherwise, <laughs> um, otherwise, well, I've, I've caught more than some people around me. Done my best. I've really fished well, but certainly the second half of the match, I think I've done really well. But last cast, 24 centimetre white in, uh, which has kind of helped me out a bit. But all in all, enjoyable nights fishing. I've done pretty well in the second half of the match. Let's see how we got on in the results. Right, so a really, really enjoyable night. Uh, I've not really done many midweek matches before, um, but it's, I mean, what else was I going to do on a Tuesday night? I'll be standing hibernating, and it's kind of nice to get out uh, and have a go. Now, we have good news. Um, I thought I did all right. Uh, I thought I fished well, but I actually ended up uh, picking up fourth in my zone, which is... Um, I'm like really, really happy with. We needed some sort of a result because it's been a bit of a rough old year. Well, last year with injuries and bits and bobs, and I couldn't really do what I wanted to do. Uh, but to get a fourth in my zone in the brand new SLO midweek league, I'm just absolutely over the moon. <laughs> uh, I actually, that, that sizable white in I had in the last cast, I actually beat Dino unbelievably on my left hand side. Um, yeah, I, I think, looking back, because there are only three and a half hour matches. Um, now, the first hour, I wasn't quite on it. Now, most people caught all their fish in the first hour, and um, I didn't really catch much at all in the first hour. And it was because I, I just wasn't quite on it straight away. Because what I do normally, I mean, what you don't see, is the normal sort of matches we do are obviously start in the daytime. Now, I always aim to get signed on and on the beach, and I'm on the beach and set up a good hour and a half before the start of the match, and that's when I'm messing about, doing the filming. There's quite a lot with all these filming bits and bobs that I have to do, so I have to get everything ready, everything set up. I've got more to set up than everyone else. Um, these midweek matches, you sign on, you've got to run to the beach, and you're almost fishing straight away. I was kind of messing about. It caught me out. I was a little bit out of sync, so... That's something for me to take away for the next one. Be the first to sign on, get straight to the beach, do any little bits and bobs and filming or whatever I can straight into fishing. Uh, I mean, 
Obviously, trying to self-film a fishing match is quite hard work, uh, and you have to be quite prepared to be able to do it all. But anyway, all in all, brilliant night. I mean, I haven't seen the full results yet, but I know Nick won our zone. Um, so he must have been the lower numbers, between one and four somewhere. Um, I was peg eight, uh, and I think, was it six top or... No, six sizable white in and a couple of top-up white in. I just beat Dino to my left. Um, and then the winner of the whole match was from zone B in the higher numbers, uh, which seemed to fish a bit better in the higher numbers. Uh, Darren Bond, again, <laughs> he won. But I, I don't know exactly what got. I think he had 14, 15 sizable fish. I think that was his total weight. So not a massive amount of fish, especially for Darren. And that, them high numbers seem to fish a bit better. But it don't matter. Uh, you fish to your zone in this game. And... I'm absolutely over the moon to have a fourth. I've looked like Darren Bond, for example, he won't fish them all the midweek. And I think there might be someone else um, who comes second or third in the zone that aren't, isn't fishing them all. So that, that, that elevates me up a little bit. I'm, you know, I'm up there in the league. So if we can have a bit of a run, a bit of consistency, um, we could have a good end of year position. Of course, all my focus is really going on that big main Southern League and Opens on the Saturday. Uh, that's really what I want to do well. But if we can have a bit of a run this midweek, give me a bit of a confidence boost, we can do it. Probably worth noting the midweek Southern League and Opens is nothing to do with the main Saturday Southern League and Opens. It's two complete separate leagues. Um, but yeah, we will have a go. Do subscribe to follow my angling adventures and hopefully we can have a few more results.